So hey guys, this is Pixel 8a and it is going to be a compact flagship as we have already seen some live images of the Pixel 8a. Yes, it is definitely smaller and lighter than the Pixel 8 and Pixel 8 Pro. The Pixel 7a has a boxy look while the Pixel 8a has a similar Pixel 8 like rounded curve corners. The top side of the 8a has a thick 6.1 inches form factor, the chin and bezels are quite decent, but that's ok for a device that will cost $499. The great thing about the Pixel 8a is that it is coming with the Tensor G3 silicon so you will get all the latest powerful AI magic tools with IP in this device. But we won't see 7 years of OS and security patches for this one since it's likely to be a flagship exclusive. But it will get 4 years of OS and security patches every month which is plenty for most of us. When it comes to performance, the Pixel 8a has achieved a single core score of 1218 and the multi core score of 3175. Speculation abounds that Google may retain the same camera hardware but with a focus on further optimization for the Pixel 8a. Some renders of the Pixel 8a have been revealed by on leaks and smart breaks, which matches up with the leaked live images. It still has dual camera so it's going to be super wide and take some amazing photos and videos and you will also get all software magic tools. It is anticipated that the device will have a 90Hz of display similar to the Pixel 7a, a fingerprint scanner and more accurate face ID and of course the device will run on latest Android 14. The timing of this leak should be taken with a pinch of salt, however nothing appears to be out of the ordinary. It is expected that the device will be unveiled at Google's annual developer conference Google I.O. in May of the following year. But with such an early leak, almost anything is possible. So what do you think about this Pixel 8a? Let me know in the comment section below. With that said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.